Bill Oberpfaffenhofen. Go ahead, Oberpfaffenhofen. Oh, you're ready for the Ted Free Pass briefing. Go ahead, please. Okay, next TED pass is at 11 hours 09 minutes. Expected satellite state is sending telemetry in high rate uplink sweep as soon as possible. Copy over from open. High rate sending telemetry uplink sweep as soon as possible. Copy right hand. The German Space Operations Center has successfully executed more than 60 space missions since 1969. Missions with different purposes involving spacecraft of all kinds. Spaceflight contributes significantly to the shaping of our lives. Space research brings us new insight into the origins of the solar system, the planets, and with that knowledge of life itself. Satellites provide important data about our environment and make global communications possible. Most communication satellites are orbiting at an altitude of about 36,000 kilometers. Challenging best describes the task of precisely positioning and operating them. For many years, this has been one of the primary functions of the GSOC. Earth observation satellites use many methods of measurement. The data they gather is interesting for research and business applications. Ground stations equipped with antennas are needed to communicate with the spacecraft. The GSOCs are located at the central German ground station in Weilheim, which is home to a range of antennas. Data exchanges between the control room and satellites takes place via these dishes. Multi-mission operation is a speciality of the German Space Operations Center. From the control room, Technicians can control several satellites simultaneously. The method is flexible and efficient. On-orbit servicing includes inspection, towing and maintenance of satellites in orbit. New special procedures for space robotics are being developed to make it possible. Together with DLR's Robotic Institute, the EPOS facility has been set up for the optimization of maneuvers. Approach and docking between two satellites are being simulated here. The operation of the European Space Laboratory, Columbus, is directed from the GSOC. More than a hundred scientists and engineers work here. The control room is manned round the clock to monitor and control the Space Laboratory's technical systems, as well as to support the astronauts aboard the ISS as they work on scientific experiments. The GSOC is the leading European facility for manned spaceflight. Station Munich for Mike, thanks a lot, it was a pleasure working with you. The German Aerospace Center DLR sees research as the work it does for society. We aim to go on with research and development projects to make further contributions to the future.